Hi everybody, it's Mike from Cradle Point. We're here today at a pop-up retail sneaker store and we're gonna talk about how easy it is to add 5G to their existing network. We're here in beautiful Carmel, Indiana, where this business owner is currently using a Cradle Point E300 router as the network hub for his small business. And what he does with it is he connects a laptop, multiple smartphones, all into his point of sale system. He also has multiple security cameras around this place, which can require a lot of bandwidth. And his current situation has been working okay, but he's been hearing a lot about 5G. And he's saying, how do I add 5G to my network and what are the benefits? So I'm here today to help him out and show him how easy it is for him to go ahead and add 5G to his existing network. So why would this customer upgrade to 5G? Well, there's two primary reasons. Number one, 5G offers a bump in bandwidth or speeds. Today, it's certainly a little bit faster and in some areas, it's a lot faster. So this customer is running multiple clients off their network and by adding 5G, he has more bandwidth available for those clients. You know, second, and maybe more importantly, the 5G networks are going to start to really become much more robust and mature over time. So by upgrading with uh, equipment from Cradle Point that is 5G compatible, customers are essentially 5G future-proofing themselves. So they are ready for the upgrades and the network changes that are happening with 5G. Making an investment in 5G with Cradle Point today is gonna pay off down the road. So how do you upgrade to 5G? So this is actually the easy part. Cradle Point makes routers, but Cradle Point also makes a product called an adapter. The cellular adapter is what is going to be used in this particular situation to provide a 5G connection. So what a Cradle Point adapter does is it provides a cellular based Ethernet connection to an existing router or SD WAN appliance. This is essentially a cellular modem in a box with antennas and then it connects via Ethernet cable to an existing router. So you just plug it in. This actually has power over Ethernet capabilities. And you see the PoE injector right here. And so you just take the adapter and you place it somewhere where you have good cellular reception. And the great thing about connecting via Ethernet is that you can go up to 100 meters without signal loss. Plug it in and the router sees that connection as just an alternate WAN connection. It doesn't know the technology behind that. It just knows that it has internet access. So these adapters are easy to set up. You simply insert an active SIM from your carrier of choice. In this case, we've got AT&T in here and you make sure the antennas are positioned properly and configure it in NetCloud Manager and you are good to go. AT&T has a group of rate plans that are really great for cradle points. They're called AT&T Wireless Broadband and they're actually speed-based plans. They're, they're built just like they would be a wireline circuit. And you can buy a 12, 25, 50, or 100 megabit circuit, essentially. It's just delivered over the cellular network. And these work really, really well with Cradle Point adapters and, and Cradle Point routers. So today we just easily added 5G to an existing network router. 5G adapters can be easily ordered via AT&T. And if you're an AT&T seller, you can leverage the Cradle Point Express Center or order uh, immediately via Opus. And if this has been interesting for you and you want to learn more and you're with AT&T, please log into your PLE learning system and search on Cradle Point and you can take our Network Ninja training and get certified on Cradle Point technology.